How do you make a background black and white but keep the person colourful in Lightroom Classic? To do this you're going to need to use a mask, so come up to the masking tools here and either click this or hold down shift and press W on the keyboard. Next you want to come down to this background button and click it and Lightroom is going to try to automatically work out what the background is and what the subject is. This red area here is what's been selected as the background, however if I zoom into my leg here by pressing Z on the keyboard and hold down spacebar and drag it across, you can see that my leg under this table has been included as part of the background, which we don't want. So what we can do is we can subtract some of this red mask away by clicking the subtract button here. And there's a few different options you can choose from. For example, you can choose to subtract an object. And what we need to do now is paint over what the object we want to subtract is. So I'm just going to do this quite roughly for this demo. Lightroom's going to try and work out what part of that was an object. You can also click the subtract button multiple times to keep subtracting areas from the background. For example, you can use a brush, make sure the flow is set to maximum and the feathers fairly small, and then just paint over the areas that you don't want to be included in that mask. While you're subtracting from the mask with this brush, if you do see some red, even when you go over it like this, make sure that your density is also set to 100. You can see now, as we paint over, the red disappears. So I just did a really quick job there. You can spend more time on that yourself. And once you're happy, the whole background has been selected with this red mask. To make it go black and white, come down here to the saturation slider and reduce this all the way to negative 100. If you do still see some colour in the background, like this grass here, come up to this amount slider and increase this all the way to maximum. You can see now the background is completely black and white, but the person has stayed in colour.